OK, we are ready to create the first crash test. I've opened the model exported from Aviva E3D. The model may seem different to you as I've included soft volume and insulation volume as different translucency percentage. We create the crash test by selecting the add test. The test is created with the default name. It is good practice to change the name to something to represent what this crash is about. For this case, it may be a pipe versus structure crash. We can also import crash test that was saved previously in a file. We select the files to be imported. We do this basically to standardize crash test to consider for the project that we do. From the crash test that we've imported, we will select one of the crash tests and we select the objects that we want to check for this particular crash test. Now that we have selected the objects in the right and left panel, we have set up the two objects to be checked for crashes.